Hi everyone, today I'm going to talk to you about the top 6 uh, Slack and GitLab merge request integration. Uh, so let's start. So first, Axolotl. So I'm the co-founder of Axolotl. The reason why I created Axolotl is that I couldn't find anything like this out there. Uh, I will present you what, what is Axolotl. Um, so let's, let's see, let's say you have a, a Slack. Uh, you probably have a bot, uh, somebody telling you when, whenever there's a merge request. And the idea of Axolo is to create one Slack channel per merge request. And then all that information goes into that same channel. And whenever you merge or close that merge request, um, this channel gets archived. So yeah, one merge request, one Slack channel. Um, the idea of Axolo is really to reduce period time, um, like merge request time, by reducing pickup time. Uh, we think if you manage to short that time, uh, you will be much more productive as a developer. Um, there's less context switching. That means you don't have to switch between Slack to GitHub, or sometimes you have to make a call to talk about the merge request. Um, everything is in Slack. And because it fluidifies communication, uh, we think it makes a better code base uh, overall because you can easily talk about um, the code in, in a like, super easy way. Um, so maybe I can show you quickly how it looks like. Um, for us, this is installed on, on GitHub, but um, it works the same on GitLab. So first you have a Axolo general channel where every time somebody uh, creates a merge request, it creates a notification here. So we can see, uh, let, let's look at this one, for example. Um, we can see the, the name, the, the number of the pull request, uh, the name, and there's a channel associated with it. And there's some emojis here. Um, those emojis are uh, done automatically by Axolo, and uh, they, they all mean something. So for example, this one, um, Arthur has asked for me to uh, review, and then I approved the pull request, and then it was merged. So this one is actually archived, but uh, we can have a glance. Um, so he created uh, the merge request, and then the, the CI passed, and then we made a bunch of code comments uh, that we can see here. And then I approved it, and then uh, Arthur merged it. It's pretty straightforward. Um, Simple, it makes a job. Oh yeah, and there's a bunch of bookmarks with uh, important information in there. Uh, so yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it looks pretty easy and uh, it is, and it, it does a job. Uh, you can also see your current merge request in the home. Um, yeah. So uh, that's it about Axelo. Um, let's look at CodeDog. CodeDog is a, simple uh, Slack GitLab integration where you can define a channel for uh, notifications um, and reminders. So you, you will get reminded whenever, whenever there's a pending pull request or merge request. Uh, it's pretty easy to configure. Um, the problem we see is that for bigger teams, uh, you can create one channel, but it's going to get ignored at some point. Uh, because it's super hard to look at all the notifications from a whole team. Elementor, uh, this is another bot we found, which is also available on GitHub. Um, they, they can send direct messages uh, for um, a reviewer asking for reviews. So that's, that's pretty good. Um, it's free, it's simple. Um, and for the CI and CD, it only integrates with CodeShip and Circle CI. I, I mean, I wish it was integrated with more, uh, like, um, yeah, like more of them. <laughs> uh, Zapier and Integromat. So if you already have a Zapier Integromat subscription, I think it makes a lot of sense. Um, you can create channels uh, for different type of events. Uh, Here's a screenshot, but you, you can dig into it and uh, you will see more of them. Uh, so it's highly configurable, especially if you have three-step processes into Zapier, you can filter out um, 
by label or anything like that. Uh, apart from that, I think it's a very shallow integration. Uh, there's no information on deployment or it can also be expensive. We found an open source GitLab Slack integration from uh, Nazrin. So it's out there on, on GitHub, you can find it. Um, it's open source, you can contribute to it. It was only updated two years ago, so uh, it might not be up to date though. And finally, uh, the official Slack and GitLab integration. What we found with this one is that it integrates really well with issues, uh, but not so well with merge requests. Um, so yeah, I mean, it, it's really good if you use the GitLab issues, um, but that's it. So as a, as a conclusion, um, most of the bots out there that we found um, are like simple reminder apps or simple notification bots. Um, what we aim to do with Axelo is to like make a truly collaborative app that uh, allow you to talk and uh, correspond on a merge request to get the work done. So that's it. Uh, thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to uh, uh, ask a question in the comment. I'd be happy to uh, answer them.